A question I often ask people, uh, particularly HR directors, when we're talking about um, them needing to fill certain positions is when you hire people, do you hire based on the titles that they show in the resume or do you have a skill set that you've identified and you go looking for? The reason I ask this is very often people fall into the trap of having a very limited scope uh, in their search for new talents. Um, if we need a new, well, we'll use sales director as an example, either do we promote one of our existing sales managers or do we look for someone who is a sales director in another company, preferably within our industry? And this is what I mean by hiring on title. The example I give is uh, a good friend of mine is a highly successful sales director, an Asia-Pacific director, um, but he's an engineer by trade. And when um, his superiors came to him with the job offer to be their Asia-Pacific sales director, he thought there'd been a, a mistake in the paperwork, that they'd got the wrong person. He'd never worked in sales. He'd never sold anything. They must have made a mistake. But they explained to him that they had a very clear requirement in terms of skill sets. They needed someone who was good with people, someone who had leadership ability, but not a huge ego, that he didn't need to override these characters because his sales team were, often by definition, fairly egotistical, very confident guys. They needed someone who could lead these group of alpha males without competing against them. Um, they needed a guy with a great deal of international experience. They needed a guy who could get things done on time. And when they looked at his background, they realized that he was very good on projects, that he hit deadlines. They, uh, when he listened to them, he thought he'd give it a go. Um, and since then, he's become the most sale, uh, successful sales director that they've had. And it's all because they hired based on the skill set rather than the title.